Good afternoon, everyone. Um, I'm Angie. I'm the new product manager of Crew Republic Company. And we are a startup company in craft beer industry. And today, this talk, the purpose of this talk, will be let you uh, know us, understand us more. So I'll spend around five minutes to give you a brief introduction of our company. And I've divided into three parts. First of all, I'll talk about the history. Be, uh, since we are the startup company, so actually we don't have a long history. So this part will contain the uh, why we why did we build this company and the pres present situation. The second part will be the main product, and this is the most important part because it represent representative us and. At last, I'll talk to you about our mission and future outlook. If you have any questions, I would like to answer them at the end of my talk. So, let's get started with the first part, history. Okay, uh, German beer, for a long time, German beer has been considered the most, uh, has been considered tra traditional beer. So, um, Actually, uh, it's, it's not a true, but it is a true. Because in Europe, or in, uh, in Europe, the way that the brewing beer, it, it's actually for a long, long time. In German, it's over five, 500 years. So, um, some people might think that uh, for the people who really love German beer, they think that it's really classic. But for some people, they think that it's actually boring. Because in this country, they even have a law called German Beer Purity Law. So many brewing, uh, many craft beer uh, companies, they produce their beer under the law, under the limit, and under this kind of uh, limitation. So most most of the beer's flavor actually are very similar, and also the style, also the bottle, and their package. It's very, very uh, unlike with other countries in, in, in Europe. So here we are. We are the company that who stands up to break the people's image for this kind of situation. We want to make people think that the beer in this country are not just boring. Okay, our two leaders, Mario and Tim, they were business consultants. They traveled around the world and they discovered a beer named Elpel. After they drank it, they decided this is what we want for Germany. So while they got back, they quit the job and they developed a new recipe and they found a brewery to produce our own Pell L. And it released at 2011 and we named it as Drunken Cellar. And this bottle led us won the European third European beer star with a third place. And this is how we start our company and this this is also how we start our journey. So now you might curious about our product. So let's move on to the second part, the main product. Today I'll introduce you two kinds of our beer. First bottle, Munich Easy. This is actually really, really perfect for summer. You can see that uh, the color of this beer is actually light golden. And this beer, uh, we, we actually put um, some of the ingredients to make this beer uh, more sweeter than other beers. So in the summer, it's very suitable for you after you soak up with the sunlight. So, uh, after you drink this beer, you may taste some of the almond or orange flavor, and also it has some caramel inside. Okay, let's see next bottle. As our my milestone of the revolution in our company, we named it as Foundation 11. And this beer actually is very unique because we put three times hops than other uh, standardized beer. So after you drink, uh, after you drink this beer, you'll feel like it, it's a little bit bitter. 
And also the color is amber. It's darker than uh, the former one. And you can smell like uh, some flower flavor. Uh, so you can smell of some flowers inside of it. And these two bottles actually are the best selling in our company right now. So if you want to check more uh, information of our products, you may uh, search them online. Then you will see the product page like this. Then we will give you all the details and where you can buy now. Okay. And that brings me to the final part of my presentation. It will be mission and future outlook. Our goal for the future is actually not become the biggest uh, brewing craft beer company in the world because we only selected the unique bar and restaurant to sell our beer. The way we do is actually very similar to um, Apple in the first stage. We want to make people really, really recognize our, uh, our, our special place, uh, our special quality in our beer. So every beer we put every our effort on it and we hope that we can collect all people as our fan. And in the future, we even hope that hopefully one day we can hold a fan, we can hold a fan club in the world and in different countries. So the, our dream is not to become the biggest company. Our dream is to become the, uh, the unique company. Then we can have the same hobby of this kind of issue. And And that brings me to the end of my that brings me to the end of my presentation. Sorry. Our company stands for honest and the only one thing we are doing right now is dedicate us um, into creating new varieties of beers. So we put our voice and our thoughts in every bottle. The great man Gandhi once once said my life is my message. Well, we are not as great as Gandhi was, but I would like to invite you to join our work and you may receive the message that we want you to hear. So your beer, our message, that's bottoms up. Thank you.